Hi, I'm Randy. I'm Matt. And I'm Deanna. And you're watching Word, Word of, of Mouth. You asked me in here to explain something to me as a child that I did not understand, but I came to explain something to you. You are not God. You ask me why I came here? I came here to instruct you. Today I saw Oleana. It's set in a uh, college professor's office. Um, after hours, classes are done, a student comes in to talk about a bad grade that she's gotten. The play starts out and he's in the middle of a phone conversation while his student Carol is sitting there kind of waiting for him to get off the phone. He seems very stressed out. He is, I guess, closing on a house and he's on the phone constantly with his lawyer and his wife. He is extremely jittery. He can't finish a sentence. He's, you know, he's clearly rushed for time. He's got a house closing that he's trying to manage. In the meantime, there's this student in his office who wants to discuss a grade and, and he's pulled in these two directions. He sort of takes pity on her and decides that he's going to give her special attention and give, give her the opportunity to start over or potentially earn the better grade. And suddenly you find out that uh, the student is not so innocent and the professor is in a real jam. He's, he's uh, in trouble. Bill Pullman played John. You know, John is this extremely ner nervous guy. Um, he seemed, you know, there was a lot for him to be nervous about, I guess, during the play, but he, ju he did it very well. I mean, it was almost uncomfortable just to watch him. It's a role that fits him well, and uh, very believable that all of this stuff that's getting thrown at him and, and the way he reacts to it, you can tell he's boiling inside and he has to keep his cool and he has to sort of remember where he's at, that he's this professor, that he's in charge, so he thinks. Julia Stiles is terrific. She's um, truly a, a gifted theatrical actress. Um, her facial expressions, her, her body movements, and I think the, um, the language of Mamet can be a little difficult. Um, there's a lot of staccato conversation, and, and she seemed to handle that very well. It sounded very natural. She was very intense. Um, she had to cry a lot, and she had to kind of go through all these different emotions, and you could really see it on stage. I thought she did a great job. Some of the lines felt like the timing or something wasn't quite on. It was more like delivering lines and less like acting and feeling the part. But as the drama started to increase and as it got more intense, I think her acting really s stepped up then. and. Uh, along with Bill's. I was really close, I was on the second row, and I just really felt when, you know, they, they argued a lot and got really loud, and I got really into their acting, but the storyline didn't do it for me. I liked it. I liked it on a, you know, psychological level. It's, it's something that you're definitely going to talk about, you're definitely going to think about. There's a lot of questions that arise in the play, right or wrong, you know, sexism, uh, the value of higher education, you know, those are just a few of the topics that come up. It's more of an experiment in um, power dynamics between a man and a woman, and the question in the experiment is, who has the power, when, and why? And, and that's a way of answering questions that we have about how we live in society as men and women. That's how I saw it, as a social experiment. Halfway through, I'm sitting there going, this is a play about a professor and a student having conversations, and it, I didn't get it at all. I, I felt like there was a deeper meaning, but went way over my head. If you're not into very deep conversations about you know, social topics, uh, don't go to it. No, I would not recommend this to my friends. Um, it's just, I don't think it's anything that they would like. Um, even my friends that are probably super smart and would probably get all the deep meaning um, to pay that much for a ticket, and I don't know, I just didn't think it was worth it. I liked it. Um, it's not for everybody. I think if you are a real lover of theater and a, a lover of um, Mamet, certainly, and you're into um, 
you know, going, having that experience of going to theater and having your mind provoked and walking out and thinking, you know, what just happened? What did I see and what do I think about it? Then this is the kind of play for you. We can settle this now, right? And I just, I want you to sit down, all right? Just sit down. Excuse me. Sit down. It seems that we, just wait a moment, wait a moment, just, just do me the courtesy. Let me go. No, I have no <coughs> interest in holding you. I just, I just, please, just, hey, Let I just go. want to talk to you. Let me go. Would somebody help me?